Hey guys, it's Wednesday. As you can tell, there's a bit of a change in scenery this week. I'm filming on my bed because I wanted to get you on my bed. Oh yeah. But last Sunday, I went to a Nerdfighter gathering and it was awesome and weird. I mean, it was just awesome because everybody was there and we were doing uh, pretty much Harry Potter and Nerdfighter like things. Then it was weird at the same time because I don't know. I feel like a lot of people were talking a lot more than I was talking to people. I, I don't I don't talk to people a lot. I'm not really like when you have like a scale of socially awkward people, uh, you have the popular people and then you have the socially awkward people on one side. I feel like most of the Nerdfight Carrier is really close to socially awkward, but not all the way there. I feel like I'm all the way there. Seriously, the only friend I actually talk to on a normal basis is my girlfriend. I brought her along to uh, the nerd fighter gathering with me, but um, she refuses to be on camera, which is why I'm going to sneak some footage of her in this video. Just to let you know, my video is not the first video of this gathering. There's other videos of this gathering up on the internet, and if you want to see them, you could view them. Yeah, I'm actually just going to put them here, so you can click, clickety-click, if you want to see that um, other video that was put up of this Nerdfighter Gathering. If there are other videos, I might put other links around here. They get uploading um, during the week. I'll just put those links around my face. Without further ado, and I'll try to um, talk a bit to tell you what's going on, because I was watching some of the clips and they're really random. Here's the Nerdfighter Gathering. Nerdfighters! So today, we're going to the Nerdfighter Gathering in front of the Museum of Natural History here in New York City. We're waiting for the train. I'm a bit late. To tell the truth, I am a bit late. Uh, it starts at 2 past 1. It's going to take more than an hour to get there, but uh, we'll see what happens. And I'm here with my girlfriend, Donna. Let me get the camera. She is shy. She likes to run away. We made it here to the North Feather Gathering. Over there it says DFTVA on that little post, and there's a bunch of people. I came like just in time, seriously, like one minute before we all went to the park. They're recording, and we're all recording, and we're all like vlogging at the same time. But yeah, we got like a whole group of people, a huge, huge group of people. See, people are waving their hands. Hey! It's pretty awesome. So as you saw, we were in front of the Museum of Natural History, but we decided to go into Central Park to have a place to sit down. So the footage that I'm showing you now is the footage that I took while we were on our way wandering through Central Park looking for a nice big grassy area to sit down and have some fun. Did anyone bring a blanket so we could sit on the grass? We have music as we're walking through the park. After much walking, I think we finally reached a lawn where we could just chill. It's pretty cool and big here. We got like some people playing sports over there. A lot of people sunbathing, reading books. Oh, that's a cool Tetris shirt. Okay, are we talking about Danny or I'm the only nerd here, apparently. Yeah, good call. That's all set. Yeah, it's pretty, it's too hot to be standing up. Neville uh, would have done it in four books. Oh, that's an awesome shirt. Two guys with the pizza shirts. <laughs> and Neville Longbottom shirt, and that's just pretty cool. I think I recognize her. I think she has a channel about books, but I'm not quite sure. Who wants to go to the shade? Yeah! <laughs> oh, yeah, it's like as soon as we move the cloud, the sun gets blocked by clouds. <laughs> I think the sun just doesn't want to see the snow. It's, it's, it's Murphy's Law. <laughs> exactly. Murphy's Law. That's what it is. Yeah! Hi! <laughs> You have a YouTube channel, right? Yes. You review books? Yes. Yeah, I, I, I think I'm subscribed to you. Cause, really? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's exactly My name is Jonathan. I don't say much, but I watch. Hi. <laughs> I knew I recognized her. <laughs> it's a small world after all. Yeah. Hi. At this point, that I decided we should sing happy birthday. Two, three. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Harry. Happy birthday to you. Alright, so now it's the queen. Alright. Okay. One, two, three. 
Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear J.K. Rowling. Happy birthday to you. After a while, we split up into subgroups, and different subgroups did different things. The subgroup I was in decided to play Mafia, a game I've never played before. But hey, I'm at a Nerd Fighter gallery, so I was willing to try new things. No wonder you're in such a deep sleep. I know. Thomas went to Derm's train and fell off of an iceberg. Oh. Pushed off of an iceberg, a la Ron Weasley's imagination. Um, so, unfortunately, he died. <laughs> Yeah, it's cool as death, go as death goes, you know, so... Very, very cool. ...the subgroups, and right before I left, a group of people decided to do the time warp. Yes, the time warp. <laughs> oh, come here. That's awesome. <laughs> so as you can see, the Nerd Fighter gathering here in New York was crazy awesome. It was cool because we got to see new people and we got to do cool things and if, even if it's just something that we did that we never go to another one again, it's just something cool that we did. Anyway, I know I'm well over my time but um, I just wanted to get all those clips in. Mary, I'll see you tomorrow.